agency will continue to use its verification expertise to help make the JCPOA uh, sustainable. Throughout this year, as in previous year, the agency will hold or host uh, a number of major meetings and conferences covering all the wide range of activities the agency is in promoting or is involved in. And these meetings will be expected to have high level participants uh, from across the world. I will not go through all these meetings because there will be a longer list, but I will mention some of the highlights. And, and if you want to have more information, of course, there's a lot of them on the IA website. So starting in March next month, um, the 80 contracting parties to the Convention on Nuclear Safety, also known as the CNS, uh, will begin a two-week meeting at IA headquarters in Vienna. They will discuss the deficiencies and strengths in national programs and how to improve nuclear safety worldwide. This will be the seventh CNS review conference since it entered into force in 1996. The previous meeting was held in 2014. And for those who are interested, there are already some country reports um, that have been submitted and posted uh, on the meeting website. Uh, so that goes from late March to early April, two weeks. Um, moving on to May, um, the IA and the Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations, FAO, will organize and hold a major international conference on new developments and challenges in the area of insect pest control. Um, as you know, insects cause increasing damage to livestock and crops around the world and also spread human diseases like malaria and Zika. Zika, of course, was very much in use uh, last year. Um, we expect about 400 participants.